My favorite part is reporting and like getting out there and being with the people and getting into your community and finding out, like being a part of the news. The most interesting part was being able to use our own creativity and create videos and stuff with teenage topics that more teenagers around the world can get used to and understand better. The experience was really valuable because it um, allowed students to apply the literacy skills that they've been honing hopefully for years in the classroom. Um, they were able to apply it in the real world. I think something so exciting about this is these kids are tuned in and they're interested yeah. and they're aware. And I think doing the stories from young people's perspective really spreads that. First year we did stories about football games, different things like that, but when PBS came to us and kind of pitched this, you make a documentary, here are four topics, you choose from them, we're going to give you the B-roll, you need to go out there and find the story and find how it relates to your community. I'm not the kind of kid who's going to sit in a math class, who likes to sit in a math class or an English class and do assignments all day and then just get a test at the end of the quarter. I learned so much more from working with PBS and making this documentary than I ever have in class. One of the things that I really enjoyed last year with the students that were working on the PBS project was the way they, it, it took them time, but then when they, when they identified that story, um, the way they, in, in essence, engaged with their local community. These students were going out and they were, in essence, being just like real reporters. They were in, engaged into the community, they were interacting with uh, business professionals. As students, we still do need a little bit of structure and a little bit of guidance because it's a big, bad world of media out there. And if we don't have a script to kind of go off of to sound as professional as we can, then we aren't going to be seen as professional, we aren't going to create a product that um, is as quality as we want it to be. Um, and through those, those resources that News Hour gave us, we were able to create things that I think both of us are very proud of. Through these projects, teenagers become more aware of like worldwide events and stuff. And, um, and if we did it on a more, I wouldn't say childish level, but if we did it on, on a level that more teenagers could relate to, then they would be more opted to watch it and understand it and learn about it. Instead of watching grown-ups talk on the news, because it might be a little boring. <laughs> like, through working with this, I found something I want to do. I just want to develop my skills with media literacy more to be an expert and to, to be a journalist and to be able to develop my opinions and project them in the world. And without this program, I don't think I'd know that I, that's what I wanted to do. It also really helps you learn about you know issues today, current issues that you wouldn't have known otherwise. And I just feel a lot more enlightened because I know a lot more that now after doing the PBS Reporting Labs than I did before I started it.